oh if you guys can see how dark it is right now it is like 2 30 it is 2 30 in the afternoon If you guys are curious about this makeup look that I have on today, I did a full tutorial for it, so you can check that out on the channel as well. There. Okay, hi! Hello beautiful and welcome. Today we're doing something really exciting. I'm so excited to show you guys a massive Shein haul. So, whether you're looking for some great basics, you're looking to fill some gaps in your wardrobe, or you need some new style that you're really not sure about, I feel like Shein is the ultimate shop for fashion right now okay actually you know while i'm sitting here let's just get started with the first piece from Shein. i have so so many pieces to show you today the first piece that i want to show you is the tweed button down it's kind of like a shirt jacket that's what they're calling it the shacket you will literally never hear me say that on this channel because i just don't like the word but I get the concept of the shirt jacket because in some places, especially fall, the weather isn't exactly like really, really cold. So I totally get it. But for me, this is simply a shirt. There's no jacket involved here. There's no, you know what I mean? Even in early fall, I'm like, I don't think I could get away with wearing this as a jacket. Maybe in the summer, it would be like really cute over a pair of shorts. But oh, I just, I love it so much. I really hope that you guys are enjoying this. I love the detail of the pocket, how it's got the raw edge, literally like giving me 90s denim vibe. The next piece that I want to show you guys is this cute little fluffy number. Um, I did get this piece in a set. It's just like a little, wait, let's see. Uh, it's just like a little cropped tank top. I'm so obsessed with the fluffy. It's kind of like a teddy knit. I feel like this season I am into the cozy. I'm into the cozy vibes the heavier knits, the heavier fabrics. This came in a short set. So let me pick this up thinking like Netflix and chill, hanging out with a boyfriend, like all the hot cocoa, all those kind of vibes. Let me just fix my little necklace here before we go on. So the next piece that I wanna show you guys is this one. I have literally been living in this piece since I got it a few weeks ago. I actually did get it to go with this fluffy tank set, but it doesn't have the exact same colorway. Like this one's a yellow white and this one's a white white. So I love this piece though. I've absolutely been living in it. It's literally replaced my house coat because it's got a nice big hood on it. It's got Pocket. The only thing it doesn't have is like a tie. It doesn't have any kind of like belting or anything like that. Okay, so the next thing I want to show you is another button up. I did get another tweed button up and how amazing is this piece? Like the utilitarian structure of it. It's so kind of like rigid through the back and everything. Like it's got a gorgeous, gorgeous tailored structure to it that I am just obsessed with right now. I love the lift here on the side. How cool are the buttons? Like, um, real pockets, which is always nice. They aren't necessarily always real pockets. So you could tell just by the stitching here that these are definitely real pockets and they fit like a cell phone and something. I wouldn't put anything in the pockets just so you don't affect the drape of it, but I am obsessed with this fabric. The next thing that I want to show you is this gorgeous leopard print skirt. So I have been wanting to get something like this all season. I decided because this trend moved into fall that I was going to pick one up and I did find the perfect skirt. This animal print. I thought it would look so gorgeous with a chunky knit with like a big wool coat draped over it, like a tan color all the way to the floor. I'm gonna get, I love the ruching detail down the side here with the slit, you can see it. The next thing that I wanna show you guys, unfortunately did not work out. The piece that I'm talking about is this. It's a pair of pants. It's this gorgeous cognac colored pair of pants. If you guys are unfamiliar with Shein, then this is the packaging that all the Shein items that you buy come in, each individually wrapped with this awesome little slider. Do, 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 do. Everything about these I wanted, I wanted to love them. If you're local and you know me, what up? Um, I always sell stuff like this on Marketplace before I send it back to the company. So if there's anybody that locally wants these, I'll sell them for exactly what I got them for. Just hit me up. Oh my god, oh my god, look at the oh my god, it's heavy. Okay, 
so we'll go one at a time up. so dark wash denim i was definitely looking for some flare denim so i did get two different styles of flare denim just in hopes because i'm five seven right like all my measurements and stuff guys will be left in the description box for you if you're curious when it comes to size these were supposed to be the ones for my heels and they ended up being the flares for my flats which is funny so if you look at the picture I'll put up the pictures of the website so that you know which ones exactly I'm talking about um, the girl is clearly wearing high heels I mean with a pair of sneakers with a pair of Converse with a pair of sandals I just feel like these are the ultimate flare jeans that I have been looking for for forever. And I feel like my 13 year old self was so obsessed with this cut. These babies, same jeans I got in the light wash. This blue is so good. Even with this tweed piece that I'm wearing right now, I think that looks so stunning together. I'm definitely gonna pair this with some gorgeous fall colors for you guys because I wanna show you that it doesn't all have to be dark in the fall. You can definitely keep your light wash denim and rock now it. I'm also going to show you guys the picture that this flare denim this gorgeous black with white stitching so obsessed especially because this more than anything feels like the 90s to me this feels like the 90s when black wash denim clean black wash denim with white threading was so popular the picture from the website and how the girl is wearing flats and it's extremely frustrating because guess what she said five six and the girl's wearing flats. I'm 5'7", and I have to wear my chunkiest platform boots for these to not drag on the floor. Like, Look at the size of the flare. Okay, like even if I get sick of a huge 60s throwback flare like this, I easily could take that fabric in. Great thing about denim like this, if you know how to stitch even a little bit, look it up on YouTube. A hem is one of the simplest things you could do. Like a raw pair of denim and the top fits like a dream. It does. All the sizes that I bought these items in will also be listed in the link. So please make sure you click that little arrow down in the description and you open that box up. I probably will hem these and take them in a little bit so that I can wear them with my white sneakers. So I'll show you guys that process. Again, make sure you're subscribed. Uh, if you don't know, I went to school um, for fashion design and marketing. Talking more light wash denim with this retro vibe raw hem how stunning is that hem massive you can see the big triangle they cut on that flare definitely needs to be steamed or ironed out so that you don't get any weird draping over your shoes you have to press these creases out um, the best way to do that to keep them so you don't have to iron them every time you wear them is instead of folding them in on themselves like this and then having that be all flat like that you can fold them front to back like this it's like hard to hold the clothes up I didn't realize it was gonna be like so hard they're heavy so the next thing I want to show you guys is this amazing corduroy jacket it is a cropped jacket Curtis shell buttons so classic love the color of this piece I definitely wanted some more tan um, chocolate tones and browns in my wardrobe this fall. I could definitely picture this with the leopard print skirt or something. I think they go together so beautifully. I can't remember a time in my life ever wanting corduroy quite as bad as I do right now. Um, these pockets are fake and I wish they had a button on them. That's the only thing I kind of wish but it is nice and plain and simple so I do love a piece like this. I feel like for layering from fall to winter, it would be a great piece to just have in your wardrobe. Like these tweed button-ups, you could just throw it on. Okay, so this jacket, oh God, it feels like real rabbit. It's not. So elastic cuffs, which are so fluffy and amazing. It's got the elastic cuff at the bottom that just cinches you in at the waist. It definitely hits at like the perfect place. I'm so obsessed. I love the white zipper that just like blends in in the front. Nice and clean. I love the gathering effect that you get from having that snatched waist. This one is fully lined, which I love with like that faux silky kind of nylon material. There are no pockets in this jacket. That would be one of the downsides I would get. So this is another cropped faux fur jacket. This is the ultimate of the ultimate luxury that I've ever gotten off of Shein. I cannot tell you how soft this jacket is. The white one is very soft as well, but something about the texture of this one and the thickness 
it's a little bit thicker and heavier in weight than the last one that we saw and it doesn't have any kind of zipper or anything like that it's just got this big oversized collar look at that the ultimate like it's so warm it's got a really nice weight to it again so bougie with that like high-waisted denim oh um, this is something I would also wear with like an awesome sweat set like hoodie and sweatpants matching and then something like this over top I think would look amazing um, that was another fully lined jacket as well and it had no pockets in it as well just something to know final cropped jacket or like smaller kind of early fall early winter jacket that I got is this puffer jacket in this gorgeous chocolate brown color it's also got um, a faux pocket so this is also not a real pocket but it's just the zipper detail on the sleeve which I loved the detail with this massive oversized puffy collar the big chunky square puff. it's like so big and chunky it's like taking up the whole screen um, again with the elastic cuffs here very simple and it's like it's soft it's soft and squishy it's everything i wanted it to be fully lined in the same color like this is not garbage bag material stunning i will definitely be linking these pieces down below for you guys if you want to shop them for yourselves it's, when it comes to long jackets though it's wool it's wool all the way for me so i'm going to show you two different pieces that i got from shein um, really one of the two coats that I got not as great so I'm gonna show you guys first this black coat it's a gorgeous wrapped coat that I really did enjoy I mean here you can see with the lapels like there's no top stitching going on there so they just kind of like fall out they don't sit the way that they're exactly supposed to I mean you can put them the way they're supposed to and then like tie the coat I love the robe aspect of it I love the length it's not a terrible coat you know like I might even keep not it lined it's not top stitched the fabric isn't great it doesn't feel great on like if it was lined it would be so much easier to wear because you wouldn't feel it inside quite as like if you're wearing a sweat set or something not silky or slippery you can definitely feel it catching on everything um, it's got a bit of a clinging effect like a lot of low quality wools or synthetic wools do where things stick to it but that's pretty natural I mean we have a cat you know what I mean so cat hair is an issue anyways I could have gotten over that but for the price tag eh. now if this was the only coat that I had bought in from Shein today then that would be different but unfortunately I got this one next so let's talk about this bad boy camel I wanted a camel color coat, a tan color coat, something creamy. I'll get into the creams yeah, later. The buttons are stunning. Everything falls exactly like it should. It's got all the pieces that it should. It is literally a beautiful coat. When you do it up, you immediately get a sophisticated vibe. So um, I can't say enough about a camel coat. I feel like there's so much use that I'm going to get out of this, whether it's something sophisticated or something casual. So I really, really, really enjoy this jacket especially for the price tag i think it was 44 dollars. i forgot there's another thing that i'm not keeping um i got this amazing like loungewear set like these gorgeous soft fabric i love ties and stuff like that because it accentuates the waist and it's kind of this yeah like a waffle kind of thermal super soft for thermal too i was really excited about this set but unfortunately it doesn't fit me like i wanted oh this is the cute little tank top that it comes with and that's so adorable um, and it's in the same like waffle fabric. The last piece I got that I haven't even taken out of the this bag. This is one of the newest collections from Shein called Daisy. Love this. The whole new collection for Daisy is like more high quality, more cool girl, more like fashion, I would say. And still on the casual side. So, along with tweed, along with corduroy teddy puffer these are some of the trending fabrics i'm loving right now and this gorgeous quilted fabric is so amazing it almost feels like bubble wrap when you like run your fingers down the little cubes this is the cut of it so it's basically just a big oversized like the most wide oversized cropped just crew neck long sleeve. got the full kangaroo pocket in the front Another cool girl feature that I am just loving. The big oversized sleeves coming down into an elastic cuff. Are you kidding? Under the jackets, this is gonna look so amazing. Under that puffer jacket. I am so looking forward to styling all these pieces for you guys. Let me just make sure I didn't miss anything because my crazy ass will definitely go and like forget a whole section of clothing or something like that. 
I do have another haul for fall essentials coming for you guys very shortly. That'll be out next week. If you guys are interested in these kind of videos, fashion styling, beauty, skincare, that kind of casual slayer vibe, definitely make sure you're subscribed to the channel. I will be posting videos once a week. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I really hope you enjoyed this one. I hope you enjoy your shopping over the holidays. If you are going out a lot this holiday season, then I mean, you gotta do your shopping. You gotta be feeling good, you gotta be looking good, all that fun stuff. So again, I hope this video helped you. Any links, any info that you need will be down in that description bar below this video. So make sure you go check that out. That's pretty much it guys. So my arm hurts a little bit. Can we just bring this back for one second? <gasps> it's gonna be so amazing. So good, right? Okay. Well, that's Shein guys, just in case you weren't sure about Shein. Now you know. Now you know what to do with yourself. So that's that. Love you. Thank you.